So, on to that I tell you, please help me welcome your graduating class of 2019.
copy that. Open this, open that one up and tell me what it is. Because I don't remember. Middletown Music Department. This All right, that's Pride. Pride. Yep. All right, so we've got Dooley Gats and then Mini Pride. So we'll go like this. There should be a shelf in here. What? There isn't a shelf. I'm going to put them either yeah, down Yeah, I would put it. I would put them right there. It's fine. So Mini Pride, Dooley Gats first. There you go. Perfect. All right, are we seated? I think we're good. Welcome to the graduation of the class of the 2019 school year. Congratulations, graduates and families. We have a very exciting night packed with achievement and good cheer. I would like to first welcome our chorus members up for the Star Spangled Banner. Thank you very much to our senior chorus members under the direction of Mr. Gregory Bennett and Mr. Scott Test. At this time, it gives me great pleasure to ask Mr. John Perino, our board president, to the microphone to recognize those students going into the service. Thank you, Mrs. Sorrentino. You know, the term freedom is not free is as accurate today as when it was engraved on the Korean War Memorial 
in Washington, D.C., which was dedicated on July 27th, 1995. We would, not, we would not be enjoying this graduation if it weren't for our veterans who had many sacrifices for us. I'd like to ask all veterans and those serving in the military to stand up and be recognized. All veterans, please stand up and be recognized. Thank you so very much, and thank you for your service. Today, 20 of our graduates have answered the solicitations of President John F. Kennedy, made at his inauguration on January 20th, 1961, when he stated, ask not what your country can do for you, but what your country, what you can do for your country. I'm going to now call the names and recognize those students who are going into our armed forces. And please, if I mispronounce a name, it is not intentional. Could you ask everyone to be seated so that way we can recognize those names? Seated in front of the flag. Go ahead. Okay. At this time, our graduates and everyone may be seated so we can recognize our students going into the service. Thank you, Mr. Sorrentino. Nicholas Estrayas, Air Force. Please stand up. Nico Flores, Marines. Michaela Fullerton, Army. Maritza Gaten, Army. <laughs> Dean Hill, Marines. <laughs> Ariel Hernandez, Marines. <laughs> Antonio Martinez, Navy. Gabriela Martinez, Navy. Antonio Matos, Navy. Julian Mendez, Navy. Deante Murad, Navy. Jacqueline Mercado, Marines. <laughs> Ashley Morgan, Marines. <laughs> Janiel Nieves, Army. <laughs> Carlo Ortiz Ramelis, Air Force. Adrian Ramos Carrillo, Marines. <laughs> Daniel Rivera, Marines. <laughs> Edwin Rodriguez Torres, Navy. Maria Sanchez, Marines. Just a, a word about Maria. She recently, in a ceremony this week, obtained the New York State Seal of Bioliteracy. That's not an easy task, so congratulations, Maria, on that. Congratulations. Anicia Staley, Army.
you will be the 1% protecting the 99% of us. <clears throat> I wish you good luck, buena suerte, good journey, buena or nada. God bless you. God bless the United States of America. Mitty Pride. Thank you. At this time, it gives me great pleasure to ask Mr. Richard Del Moro, Superintendent of Schools, to come up and make his remarks to the class of 2019. It's certainly a pleasure and an honor to address the graduates of 2019 and to the parents, family members, and friends who are here tonight to enjoy this celebratory event. President John Perino, Vice President, Pastor John Williams, members of the Board of Education, faculty, administrators, staff, family, and friends, and most importantly, let's give it up for the class of 2019. Congratulations. Even though it has been many years since my high school graduation, I remember the evening very vividly. It was sunny. My parents were grinning from ear to ear. A celebration was to take place as their middle child was graduating from high school. What I can't remember is the name of the guest speaker and certainly none of what he said to us that night. Acknowledging this, if I can't make my speech unforgettable, I will at least try it to make it short. <laughs> if you look at the program you've received this evening, you will notice the first words on the cover, commencement exercise. The word commencement often causes some confusion because it means to begin. But tonight, many of us call this event, this celebration, graduation, which means conclusion. Graduates, this is the successful conclusion I might add to your school careers in the Middletown School District. So, how could this be a beginning? Well, one may agree, this evening is an ending of a journey that many of you began some 12 or 13 years ago. During this journey, you have toiled, studied, and strived for this day, and now it has come. This day attests to your success with a diploma signifying you have successfully completed the New York State course of study, which tells the world you are a high school graduate. But in reality tonight, as you cross this stage in a few minutes, we also caution the world for it is just the beginning of all of your tomorrows. We likely haven't witnessed a fraction of what you will accomplish as you begin your lives as members of an adult community. For some of you, this will mean joining the workforce full time. For others, as we just applauded, you will join the armed services to protect our freedoms that we all enjoy each and every day. And for many, it will be the continuation of your studies, preparing you for your chosen careers. 82% of you will continue your studies following tomorrow. 5% of you, as Mr. Perino mentioned, will be joining the armed services, and 12% will be joining the workforce. However, whatever course your future takes, Whatever highway you travel on your journey, it is my sincere hope you will look back on the years here in the Middletown School District as having prepared you 
to meet and successfully deal with the challenges you will be resented by. So after tonight, when I see you, I will greet you not as a student, a scholar in our school, but as a contributing citizen to your community, wherever that might be. With this new position, which is bestowed on you tonight, comes many rights and responsibilities. You must equally understand it also comes with many awesome responsibilities. On behalf of all the teachers and administrators, we believe the last 12 to 13 years have prepared you to accept these responsibilities and to meet those demands with kindness and conviction and equally important to always be honest. Certainly, this is the sincere hope of the faculty and staff of our school district. Use it as you begin your new life as a compassionate partner in the world. Use it to meet and successfully conquer your challenges. Use it now and throughout your life. May it serve you well. We as educators, you as scholars, have each completed our parts. So, as you say farewell to us, you say hello to all of your tomorrows. Use what you have learned here to build a more compassionate, kinder America. It is our hope your pathway will not have too many difficult obstacles to overcome. But rest assured, there will be bumps along your pathway. But you have been given the tools to continue moving forward, not backwards. So your destination will be forever filled with happiness, success, and alive with never-ending promise. We do not know what tomorrow may bring because we all know that tomorrow is not guaranteed. But I hope you will always be passionate for the underdog and fight the good fight and never let mediocrity rule the day. Denzel Washington, famous actor and director, said, I found nothing in life worthwhile unless you take risks and you will fail. On a personal level, believe me, I know disappointment and failure. Let me share one experience. I once gave up a 60-yard touchdown pass in the last 14 seconds of a high school football game being televised as the high school game of the week. My entire family and friends were watching in support of me. I looked over to the sideline and saw the coach throwing his headphones down on the ground, waiting for me. And I thought I had a better chance of survival that moment if I went to the opposition sideline. By running off the field to the opposite sideline, I knew I eventually had to face the coach's wrath, so I turned around and went to the bench where he was waiting for me. The coach's painful words spewed fire like his, from his mouth, but they helped me learn what he thought a prevent defense was and ultimately made me a better player and teammate. From that night on, I never let a player get behind me for a touchdown pass. Well, at least not at the end of the game. I learned never to give up. Denzel also mentioned that resonated for me for years, and I share this tonight with all of you. If you don't fail, you're never even trying. And remember, every failed experience is closer to your success. In closing, I leave you with some food for thought. Measure a person by the size of their heart, not by the loudness of their voice. Learn from your failures, keep moving forward, and know that life is not fair. Don't back down, always, always advocate for yourself. Reggie Jackson, the Hall of Fame baseball player, struck out 2,600 times in his career. But he is revered as a Hall of Famer 
for his 563 home runs. Error in the direction of kindness. Jeff Bezos, CEO of Amazon, and we all know that as those packages arrive at our doorstep. One day you will understand that it is better to be kind than clever. Avoid the things that will reduce you. In other words, be real. Oprah Winfrey accomplished media mogul, executive, actress, director, talk show host, and what she likes to call herself most of the time, philanthropist, to said, surround yourself with people who are going to lift you up from where you are. Be open to new ideas and be tolerant of different ideas from yours. Allow your personality to shine and to illuminate a situation where darkness prevails. Believe in yourself, and success will surely follow more often than not. And finally, never, ever give up. On behalf, almost finished. On behalf of the Board of Education, myself, faculty, all of the administrators here tonight and who are not here with us, and the entire school district, I wish you, each and every one of you, the success of a productive life, the respect of individuals that you surround yourself with, and the love of your family and friends. May your future be yours. The best of luck and congratulations to the class of 2019. Thank you. At this time, I would like to welcome Mrs. Amy Creeden, Assistant Superintendent for Instruction, to the podium to recognize the honor graduates. Good evening. I am pleased to present to you this evening the class of 2019 June Honor Graduates. When I call your name, if you would be so kind to please stand to be recognized. Anna Birmingham. <laughs> Michaela Bolson. Sierra Carasquillo. Miranda Cobo. Andrea Cortez. Sarah Cruz, Lizai Favors, Adriana Garcia, Liam Hogan, Ayana Latour Smalls, Christian Pacia, Jesus Rodriguez, Michael Russo. Myrna Sabe, Angel Star, Colin Strouch, Alexis Vega, and Emily Whitby, the June 2019 Honor Graduates. At this time, I would like to Congratulations, my honor graduates. May, you may sit. Thank you. I would like to welcome Ms. Rachel Kuntz to the podium to recognize the class of 1969. Thank you. I'm honored to welcome back our golden grads, the class of 1969. A Golden graduate is an alumni of Middletown High School who celebrated their high school graduation 50 years ago. Golden grads, if you would please rise, we'd love to thank you for coming with a round of applause and recognize you tonight. Thank you.
At this time, I would like to welcome Mr. John Perino to back to the podium to present the Martin DeLugatz Award. Thank you so much, Mrs. Sorrentino. The Martin DeLugatz Award is named for a former board member and board president. It's given to an individual who does a bit extra and quite a bit extra for the district. It's always a very difficult decision. We have many candidates to uh, choose from. This year's the 2019 Martin DeLugatz Award. The winner is Robert Simonson. <laughs> Mr. Robert Simonson formed the Unified Basketball Team in 2016, along with Dave Coates, Denise McEwen, Simonson, and Rachel Kuhn in conjunction with the Special Olympics to provide an opportunity for students with challenges to play varsity sports. These students have participated in several contests within our county. Under Mr. Simonson's guidance, these students have demonstrated sportsmanlike teamwork and exceptional grace. He has worked with the Special Olympics without compensation he refused compensation and did this as a volunteer additionally so that deserves another hand Bob <laughs> additionally he has helped with the, the Middletown community by volunteering at the Middletown warming station he has coached the Middletown Unified Basketball Team for three years. And additionally, Mr. Simonson was employed by the Monroe Woodbury School District as an adopted PE teacher and coach for 32 years and retired from teaching in 2014. So, Bob, congratulations. Well, well deserved. At this time, I would like to welcome Mr. John Williams to the podium, our Vice President of our Board of Education, to present the Mitty Pride Award. Good evening to everybody tonight, and allow me to firstly congratulate all of the graduates and the families of this great class of 2019. If I said anything to you after you leave here tonight, it would be go out and be intentionally great. The 2019 Mitty Pride Award, uh, which is an award that we award to those within the district who have uh, served with great distinction, uh, is going this year to the Middletown, in large city school district of Middletown Music Department. They have earned for the fifth year in a row the prestigious Best Communities for Music Education designation. And this is a reflection of the hard work and dedication of a group of teachers who have created learning opportunities for our students. They have demonstrated outstanding achievement in efforts to provide music access and education to all students. Music education is an important aspect of providing children with well-rounded education. Middletown schools offer general music, band, orchestra, course, and extracurricular music activities, including musical theater across the elementary, middle, and high school levels. These teachers 
are to be recognized and congratulated for this accomplishment and the impact they have on our students. Once again, this Midi Pride Award is awarded to the Enlarged City School District of Middletown Music Department, where the representative come at this time from the music department. Hmm? Uh, there she is. Amen. Our music department chair, Tony D. Pasquale. Come on, you can do better than that. On behalf of the district music department, um, thank you very much. Uh, we work hard because that's our job and we're proud of our students. Some people only dream of meeting their favorite musicians. We get to teach ours. I would also like to take a moment to recognize our honored teachers that, are be, that will be um, reading the names tonight. Each year, the graduating class votes to select those teachers who have impacted them the most to lead them in the commencement ceremony. These honored teachers also have the distinguished pleasure of announcing the names of the graduates as they receive their diplomas. This year, the class of 2019 is pleased to introduce the following honored teachers. Mr. Paul Braun, Mrs. Carolyn Dowdy, Mr. John Gerace, Mr. Marcus Herrego, Mr. James Kelly, Mrs. Carla Kidney, Mrs. Carrie Luba. Mrs. Jenny Lynn Natal. Mr. James Smith. Mrs. Jamie Sweet. Mrs. Anna Sangarakis. And Mrs. Jennifer Youngins. In addition, we are honored enough to have administrators from every building in our district here tonight because it just doesn't happen 9 through 12. It's K through 12. I would like to honor my colleagues and ask them to stand tonight, our principals, deans, and assistant principals from every building in the district. Thank you all so much. At this time, I would like to welcome Ms. Sarah Cruz and Mr. Jesus Rodriguez to the podium to deliver the commencement addresses. Good evening. First and foremost, on behalf of my class, I'd like to begin by thanking all who have made this event possible. Superintendent Del Moro, members of the Board of Education, our principal, Mrs. Sorrentino, high school administration, teachers, and most importantly, the parents, without whom we wouldn't be here today. It brings me great joy to be able to say that graduation is finally here. Class of 2019, this is our day. <laughs> this day, June 26, 2019, 
will forever stand as the day on which a chapter of our lives ended and another began. I come from a Mexican-American family where I was taught that hard work, that work ethic was everything. I never thought that I would have the opportunity to be on the stage today and share my message. I never imagined that I would then begin to further my education at MIT in two short months. It truly is incredibly humbling. Our next chapters, whether higher, higher education, the workforce, or the military for those who are brave enough to make a great sacrifice for our country, will take greater effort and deeper commitment than any of us can imagine right now. Our time here at Middletown High School has ended, and it is now time to embark on a new journey. It's hard to believe, I know, but Middletown High School isn't going to shut down just because we're leaving. With all of that said, you may be wondering, what's so special about our graduating class? I will tell you all, the answer is you. There are so many unique aspirations among my fellow graduates, and our time at Middletown has allowed each of us to explore our own distinct passions, to accompany the rigorous academic experiences we've all had. Many of us have taken on further challenges, which have shaped who we are. Graduating today are accomplished musicians and artists, hardworking athletes who understand the meaning of both physical and mental strength, dedicated individuals who have worked part-time jobs, and future leaders and public servants shaped by extracurricular activities. Though there are hundreds of different stories behind the diplomas that will be presented here today, the common denominator is that we are all prepared to take the next step and begin that next chapter. In that, I am confident. During my time here at the high school, for some reason, those who knew that I received relatively high grades loved asking me, are you the smartest person in your grade? I didn't even know how to begin answering this question because I personally never thought that high grades were the only good representation of intelligence. We are all chasing different dreams, not just ones that require textbooks. That said, I do not only stand before you due to the grades I receive. I, like many of you, am unsure of what the future holds for me. However, from my 18 years of life experience, I am sure that it feels good to be happy. Therefore, cliche as it may sound, the only piece of good advice that I can give my graduating class is this. Seek what makes you happy and pursue it. That is what will make you feel fulfilled and successful. No matter where you are going, take pride in what you do, and always remember you will be serving as a representative of Middletown. As I said, each of us has a different set of aspirations, and even though we will encounter challenges in the years between high school and the fulfillment of our goals, we can't lose touch of what we actually want to become. Don't ever forget where you came from. And remember, wherever your success may take you, once a MIDI, always a MIDI. Thank you for your time, and once again, congratulations to the class of 2019. Good evening, fellow classmates, family, friends, teachers, and faculty. It is an honor to speak in front of you all this evening. I would like to take a moment to thank the parents and teachers for without their support, wisdom, guidance, we would not be here today. Thank you to the Middletown School District Superintendent, Mr. Del Moro, Middletown High School Principal, Ms. Sorrentino, the Board of Education President, Mr. Perino, the Board of Education members, and the deans and counselors of Middletown High School for allowing me to speak this evening. I would also like to thank God for always guiding me and blessing me with the opportunity to deliver this message to you all this special evening. <laughs> Throughout our lives, we will come upon trials, obstacles, and mountains that seem impossible to overcome. However, we should keep in mind that there is no such thing as winning or losing, just winning or learning. 
As best said by the former South African president, Nelson Mandela, I never lose, I either win or learn. Learn from your previous mistakes, because the past is one of the best teachers you will ever have. Now, today I'd like to share with you seven pieces of advice in no particular order that I'm still improving on. Number one, learn to be patient. Even if what happened to you was not a blessing, learn to take it and make it into a life lesson. Not everything will occur on your time. It will happen on God's time, and his timing is perfect. Understand that the day you plant the seed is not the day you will bear the fruit. Number two, educate yourselves. Just as the Austrian philosopher Karl Popper once said, true ignorance is not the absence of knowledge, but is the refusal to acquire it. We are the future doctors, lawyers, teachers, nurses, and police officers. Do not allow your ignorance to become sincere, for it is one of the most dangerous actions you can do in this world. Number three, listen to your elders. I can already hear the murmurs of our parents in the crowd saying, mm-hmm, you got that right. We did not listen to our parents because we thought we were wise, but little did we know. Now, what differentiates a smart person from a wise person? Well, a smart person learns from their own mistakes while a wise person will learn from the mistakes of others. So honor your elders, for they have gone through many obstacles. Take the time to sit down and listen to your grandparents and their life's journeys. Turn off your phone at the dinner table. Invite your parents out to dinner or to a movie. Spend time with your uncle or aunt and appreciate the learning opportunity you have because you do not know when it will be your last time spent together. Number four, be confident. As best put by the British philosopher Bertrand Russell, the whole problem with the world is that fools and fanatics are so certain of themselves, while wise people are so full of doubts. Do not let the voices of foolish people be louder than yours. Number five, be kind. You are no better than the person next to you. Each and every one of us have and are currently facing adversity. However, we should not let our self-pity and selfishness enslave us from being kind to others. We should develop a mindset that allows the positive comments have a greater impact than the negative ones. Number six, do not hold on to old grudges. Holding on to a grudge is like drinking poison and expecting someone else to die. Do not allow your past experiences to become an anchor in your life that hold you back. And also I heard that grudges give you wrinkles and we do not want that. <laughs> Last but certainly not least, Number seven, maintain your faith. Martin Luther King Jr. once said, faith is taking the first step even when you don't see the full staircase. Faith does not make things easier, but it makes them possible. You will still need to work hard towards your goals, but do not give up, especially when you feel hopeless. That is when your faith is truly being tested. Sorry. Y para mis hispanos hablantes, si se pudo. Siendo hija de padres mexicanos, no era fácil. Y especialmente... Oh. Siendo hija de padres mexicanos, no era fácil. Y especialmente siendo la primera en ir a la universidad. Sin embargo... Mis padres me enseñaron algo muy importante, y eso es que el trabajo duro tiene su recompensa. Sí. Todos hemos pasado por obstáculos difíciles que parecían imposibles de superar, pero con un poco de esfuerzo y fe en Dios, todo es posible. Les aseguro que todos nosotros estamos agradecidos por los sacrificios y los esfuerzos que ustedes, los padres, han hecho por nosotros. Sus sueños de darnos una mejor vida llena de oportunidades se está haciendo realidad. Gracias a ustedes y gracias a Dios. Y miren lo que sus sacrificios lograron. Hoy, nosotros, sus hijos, 
nos graduamos. Mamá, papá, gracias por sus sacrificios y sus esfuerzos. Y gracias a ustedes lo hice. Y ojalá que se sientan orgullosos de mí. And as this speech comes to an end, I will leave you all with this. Always seek opportunities to learn, for it will help create better leaders for tomorrow. May God continue to fill your lives with multiple blessings and congratulations, class of 2019. At this time, I would like to welcome Mr. Scott Test and the senior chorus members for our musical presentation. Outstanding job, Mr. Tess and our senior chorus members. Thank you so much. Well, it's that time. I would like to welcome Mr. Richard Del Moro to certify our graduates. Mrs. Creedon, please stand to the podium. Have all of these 427 candidates for graduation met all of the New York State requirements for a high school diploma? Yes, they have, Mr. Del Moro. Then you are duly certified as high school graduates of New York State and Middletown High School. Congratulations to all of you.
At this time, we will be presenting our diplomas. Honor grads. Honor grads. Honor graduate, Anna Virginia Birmingham. <laughs> Honor graduate, Michaela Rose Bolson. <laughs> Honor graduate, Sierra A. Carrasquillo. <laughs> Honor graduate, Miranda Rose Cobo. <laughs> Honor graduate, Andrea Cortez. Honor graduate, Sarah A. Cruz. <laughs> Honor graduate, Lise Favors. <laughs> Honor graduate, Adriana Garcia. <laughs> Honor graduate, Liam Christopher Hogan. Honor graduate, Ayana Destiny Latour Smalls. Honor graduate, Christian Francis Garcia Pasilla. Honor graduate, Jesus Rodriguez. Honor graduate, Michael Rousseau. Honor graduate, Myrna Sabe. Honor graduate, Angel Starr. Honor graduate, Colin Strauch. Honor graduate, Alexis Lydia Vega. Honor graduate, Emily Ann Whitby. Anastasia Aserno. Marnesia Princess Lachey Addison. Audrey Alexander. Gabriella Hannah Allen. Kaira Allen. Juliana Rose Amalbert. Lanai Anderson. Alyssa Marie Aquino. Marielle Arenas Perez. Abmarie Arroyo. Tatiana Lee Aviles. Caroline Baez Velazquez. Cheyenne Marie Bailey. Ashley Balderez. Cynthia Jeanette Beam. Alexandra Rachel Bermijo Zuniga. Bianca Bermudez. Amaya Birch. 
Jasmine Kishana Blanche. Asia Bodhi. Deja Bowen. Carson Abigail Brenner. Princess Adina Brooks. Naya Page Brown. Melina Bueno. Semra Buzeski. Tatiana Alia Calderon. Liesia Marie Cardona. Michelle Carrasco Rodriguez. Elizabeth Margaret Cartwright. Jada Taina Normita Case. Kayla Cassells. Atiana Abigail Castro. Stephanie Caudle. Niazia Chula. Michelle Clara. Bless B. Haven Clark. Antoinette M. Clegg. Samantha Contreras. Estelita C. Rodriguez. Alexis Daling. Itiar De Clevio. Amber Liana Delgado. Dulce Maria Delgado Hidalgo. Caitlin Serena Delgado. Stephanie Zoe Delil. Sherry Durantes. Galen Marie Duggan. Eliza Drake. Alejandra Esquivias. Kimon Fairclaw. Ariana Monet Ferguson. Bacola Fernandez. Angie Elizabeth Flores. Jacinth Angelia Foster. Michaela Gianna Fullerton. Michaela Lynn Guerrero. Destiny Garvin. Maritza Yvette Gayton. Sabrina Gazer. Vanessa Godinez. Natalie Leonidas Gomez. Woo! Brianna M. Gonzalez. <laughs> Michaela Gordon. <laughs> Jalice Isora Grant. <laughs> Alexis Sydney Greaves. Jana Amia Guadalupe. Berta Elizabeth Guerra 
Alarcon. Gabrielle Giampo. Janelle Hamilton. Brianna Lee Henderson. Arielle Marie Hernandez. Daphne Lisette Herrera. Alexia Trinity Herman. Casey Melissa Hill. Caitlin Valentina Irizarry. Miriam Ariana Isidoro. Jasmine Nicole Jacobs. Chantal A. Jenkins Badilla. Justine Jenks. Kiera Jerez. Alexis Jimenez. Cheyenne Tony Johnson. Amanda Lee Kirkland. Kelly Kistner. Matilda Rose Knapp. Jamima David Neal LaPlante. Destiny Lewis. Juana Lizama. Mary Ann Lindemann. Atia Lino. <laughs> Hannah Rose Loeb. <laughs> Brianna Habibi Lopez. Dana Lynch. <laughs> Kiara Lynn. Right Emily Martinez Hernandez. <laughs> Gabriela Faith Martinez. Kiara J. Mays. Chrislyn Mazza. Margaret McNamara. Armani McNeely. Kenya Jahira Mendez Marin. Yasmin Mendez Hernandez. Alexandria Mendoza. Jacqueline Mercado Gutierrez. Destiny Chandani Mohan. Crystal A. Moisette. Alieri Moncada Garcia. Marilyn Morales. Ashley Morgan. Andrea Elisa Moro. Brianna K. Morrison. Perla Yerlin Munoz. Bianca Naranjo. Samaya Nasheed. Kake Endu. Jasmine Newton, Kayleanne Nieves, Daisy Ann Mame Akua Kumia Norman, Samantha Nicole Nugent, Bria Oatman, Jennifer Orea Calleja, Destiny Ortiz, Joshona P. Ortiz, 
Natividad Ortiz Casclero, Carla Ortiz Romales, Clara O'Shade, Naraya Anais Otanez Marte, Drew Beverly Overton, Yaretsi Palma, Rebecca Ann Paradis, Kelly Marilyn Paredes, Tatiana Paulino, Scarlett Joan Pilkington, Ariella Haley Pitt, Darian Pitt, Dejanay Pitt, Brianna L. Posey, Mackay Anaya Jordan Prescott. Destiny Alina Ramos. Elizabeth Ramos. Kiara Ramos. Enid Requa. Jocelyn M. Reyes. Ariana Maria Rivera, Jocelyn M. Roki, Alexandra Rodriguez, Angelina Rodriguez, Dylan Alexa Rodriguez, Jarilis K. Rodriguez. Melanie Rodriguez. Meredith St. Ville. Daisy Elizabeth Salazar. Maria Salazar Lozano. Jaina Ashley Saldana. Maria Guadalupe Sanchez Mestizo. Amia Daisy Diana Sanders. Okira Sangara. Rokia Sangara. Ionis Sasia Nieves. Amy Rose Savinon. Aaron Schmidt. Stephanie. Sigandoya Flores. Aliyah Shock. Ariana Cilicia. Kaylin Tatiana Smith. Samaya Smith. Abigail Rose Solano. Ariana Soares. Alexis Marie Soto. Callie Spielberger. Anicia Jordan Steely. Nina Stout. Ashley Strunk. Samantha Ray Sullivan. Sunaya Amani Tatum. Stephanie Twitzel Moran. Deja Thomas. Amalia Thorpe. Gabrielle Tilai. Gabrielle Elizabeth Torado. Talia Claxani Lopez. Bronte 
Tomlinson. Nisa Marie Tool. Ayana C. Torres. Desiree Torres. Avani Tripathi. Diana Vasquez Sosa. Alyssa Danielle Vega. Stephanie Vivas. Ayana Walters. Jasmine Warren. Talia White. Christina Monique Wilson. Zachary Abraham. Alexis Anselmo Acevedo. Jason Steven Albanez. Matthew Darius Allen. Izell Anderson. Alexander Aquino. Ethan Astacio. Elijah Babb. Missiel Ramon Barbosa. Jaden Joseph Becker. Nathan Charles Bedford. Robert Anthony Benahan. Ahmad Jamerson Black. Nicholas Anthony Bowman. Justin Dorian Braban. Jeremiah Azriel Brito. Makai Emmanuel Brown. Noriel James Brown. Cecil Linwood Brownridge III. Kabir C. Burgos. Joseph Cabrera. John Campas. Eric Carbajal. Jose Antonio Carino Olivera. Brian Carrasquillo. Christian S. Carrasquillo. Amir Anson Castillo. Hakeem Chambers, Seth Michael Chinona, Zachariah Chapman, Miles Tyler Charles, Terrence Michael Christian, Daquan Clark, True Ala Clark, Tristan Nathaniel Collins, William Aaron Kenrick Cook, Arturo Corona, Cesar Corona, Saul Corona, Christian Felipe Cortez Valencia, Michael Kosh, Brandon Jaden Cosme, Xavier Dalton. Kiate Amir Dawkins. Raysan Dean Marquez. Rowan Harvey Decker. Brian De Jesus. Daniel Delgado. Christopher Diaz. Damian Diaz, Darius Edwards, Jamal Ennis, Eduardo Espinosa, Nicolas Paul Estorellas, Gage Estevez, Nico Flores,
Christian Garcia, William Garcia, Javon William Gillis, Jose Alfonso Godinez, Salia S. Gonzalez, William Eloy Gonzalez, Michael Gordon, Darius Granger, Keyshawn Grant, Stephen R. Grow, Connor R. Guattery, Dijon J. He Hope, Michael Anthony Heredia, Scotty Hernandez. Dean T. Hill, O'Shea J. Hill, Atel Richard Hines, Elijah Hodges, Robert Xavier Houston, Isaac Luc Lucas Hilton, Kevin Hippolyte, Lucas Ibarra, Christian O. Javier, oh. Jeremy Jenkins, Lucas Ibarra, Christopher A. M. Johnson. Devontae Clinton Christopher Johnson. Javian Nakari Johnson. Shane K. Johnson. Anthony Rodriguez Kelly. Kamaw King. Daniel Kinsey. Trevor William Clink. Carl Philippe Lazare. Alexander Joseph Loeb. Alexis Lopez. Christian Lopez. Jaquan Madden. Daniel Neptali Maldonado. Edgar M. Maldonado. Jacob A. Maldonado. Gerald Christoph Mansfield. Michael Marte. Ramdi Rafael Marte. Antonio Edward Martinez. Nicholas Mascara, Antonio N. Matos, Shamar McDonald, Taj McClendon, Kayshawn McNeely, Mark A. Mejia. Edwin J. Mendes. Joseph Jamal Mendinghall. William Mendoza the third. Magdiel F. Mendoza Jimenez.
John Mendoza Ortiz, David Menzies, Dante Merard, Avion Mercado, Sergio Mesa Rodriguez, Ethan Miller, Tyshawn Moody, Abdiel Morales, Destin Blaze Morano, Alim Muhammad, Jabbar Muhammad, Marvin Mungo, Fabian. Fabian Alonzo Nieto. John Del Andres Nieves. Justin Noble Prince. Guillermo Nova. Emmanuel Ogun Shippe. Isaiah Jose Oliveria. Todd A. Oliveria York. Jose Olivo. Matthew Ian Almeida. Ethan M. Ortega. Kevin Alejandro Ortega. Devin Michael Ortiz. J. Sean A. Ortiz. Teofi Opejo. Roberto Pacheo. Christopher Austin Padilla. Asael Pez Hernandez. Oscar Palma. J. Ree Pearson. Uzil Perales, Chandler Perez, Kali Pickney, Jeremy Wayne Plasic, Justice Prashad, Freddie Manuel Quinones Jr., Pedro Quintero. Joshua Ramirez. Kenneth Ramirez. Juan Ramirez Reyes. Alejandro Ramos Acevedo. Laquan R. Ramos. Adrian Ramos Carrillo. Jared Ramsey. Jamian Jacob Randolph. Javon Reed. Christian Reyes. Kwamik K. Rich. Nazareth Richardson. Steve Rios. Makai Rivas. Alexis Eduardo Rivera, Antonio Joseph Rivera, Michael Jacob Rivera, Moises Rivera, James Robinson Jr., Christian Miguel Rodriguez, Edgar Rodriguez Torres, Edwin Rodriguez Torres. Kevin? Kevin? 
Kevin Y. Rojas. Joseph Rogelio Roman, Jr. Ricardo Ramiro. Ryan Jonathan Rosa. The Sean John Rosa. Justin Rosado Santiago. Octavia J. Rush. Joshan Russell. Fred S. St. Felix. Dramaine Sangari. Francisco Antonio Santiago. William Jose Santiago. Trevor Jolie Sasso Jr. Tyler P. M. Schaefer. Matthew Sierra. Charles Sivagnoli Jr. Shomari A. Simmons. Justin R. Small. James Smith. Devin E. Soto. Jonathan Tapia Cabrera. Jacob Tawil. Devante A. Thomas. Dylan J. Torres, Michael Torres. Yeah, what's the point? Steven Torres, Julio Torres, Jerry. Trujillo, Christian Urbina Cruz Jr., J. Chris Vargas, Julian Vargas Rivera, Charles Vasquez, Cesar Velasquez, Javen Velasquez, Roromelo Romero Walker. Jordan W. Washington Allen. Jakai S. Williams. And Ronald Zool to finish out the graduating class of 2019. Sorry. 